Hello dear viewer, today we are going to recreate one of the mini calendars from the social media editorial calendar template, which is this what you're seeing right over here. Let's get started. It's I do everything here manually, so I start by copy pasting, not copy pasting, what? <laughs> Just manually typing out the days of the week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I want to select the cells above the days and merge them together. I double click and I type on the week two. This I want to have aligned in the center. But then I think all these columns are a bit large because, well, we, do, we don't need that much space for a mini calendar. I highlighted everything, right click, resize columns, and give it maybe a width of 25 pixels. Okay, I'm gonna bolt this with command B on the Mac or the B button. Then we're taking this one as an example, calendar week two, and it starts on the 28th. You may think, are you going to type out every single number manually? No, I'm not because I'm lazy. So that's not what we're going to do. I'm going to reference this cell. So equals that one plus one, select this cell and drag it to the right. I need one, two, three, four, five rows. So I'm gonna just continue with that. Now I'm on the next row. And again, I'm referencing this. I want to reference this cell. So equal G4 plus one. Let's see if this works. No, it does not. That's okay. Equal A5. Now I select these first two and Damn it. There we go. Let me check if this works. Oh, it does. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> Eight. Excuse me, I was counting in my native language. There. We have five rows needed for this part of the month. We see that this month goes onto the until the 31st. And all I need to do here is overwrite it with one and press enter. As you see, everything after this overwritten number just is adjusted automatically. I don't need to do a thing. It ends on the 31st right here. So that's perfect as well. Then to make it prettier, I want to change the color of the text to something a little lighter to make it clear that we're focusing on this month. What else? I see that I bolded in this and I gave that row a highlight. Yeah, that's it. That's how you make a mini calendar. And I see that I removed the grid lines. I don't remember. So I'm going to ask here. <laughs> that's also useful. If you don't know where to find it under the menu, you can just ask the help feature and whatever you're searching for will pop up right here. And then you can click it and get what you want it. Oh, and for beautification, we can add a column to the left by right click and then add uh, insert one left and then make it a little bigger or smaller. And I want these to be aligned, all these fields in the center again, and they should be white. There we go. And if you want, you can put a nice little border around it. 